Okay. Uh, welcome to Debian Wheezy booting on the first cheap mod, the OMA 68 CPU card, which has an all winner A10 processor, gigabyte of RAM, and 4 gigabyte of NAND flash. Here we have the card in a Amphenol USB, um, sorry, PCMCA um, socket, and here is one uh, light in the way. Here is one which is in the Flying Squirrel tablet. So, um, from this, you can see uh, the NAND flash is on top here. Processor is here, four RAM chips giving you a gigabyte of memory, micro SD, uh, micro USB, and micro HDMI is just there. So, the uh, boot procedure is a little bit convoluted, but that really is the size of the CPU card. Here is a case that I've got that's going to go into. Um, we're reusing PCMCA as you can see. Alright, so on the other end of the 68, the 68 pins on there, you've got the USB, uh, SATA, Ethernet, and um, RGB TTL. Now, um, it's a little complicated for booting this up because I'm using uh, an RS232, which is uh, spiking the power. So please bear with me whilst I get this sorted out. Right, unplug the USB power. This is not the standard boot procedure that will be used. This is purely for development purposes. Short out these two pads on here. And I don't know if you can see the lights flashing, but if they flash a lot, woo, that's a power spike. If they flash a lot, they didn't. I got it right. I should now see on here, wait for that to stabilize. LS USB. Yep, you can see the 1F3FE FE8. Uh, we can now do a fell boot here, flip over to that screen and you can see you boot happily. Way kernel. Boot messages once we've got to there it's now switched over to var log kern dot log. If we do an NS USB oh yeah we go there we go a net chip technologies Ethernet thing now I come up to here the ping now we wait for over a minute because this is a cheap and cheerful four pound USB card, micro SD card, and it's rubbish. If you really want to buy four four pound SD cards, feel free. But don't expect them to take a lot of time booting up an ordering system. Let's do something else for the next 30 seconds. Um, yeah. This is the screen for the uh, Flying Squirrel tablet this is going into. Um, that's a IPS quality screen. It's actually the same one that's in the Kindle Fire, the older one. Um, when you have a card, the card, the CPU card will fit into the socket like that. Um, be removable um, by pushing the button which they've had to take off that one because they got the wrong side there you can see the push button from that one um, Wi-Fi card will go here so there'll be any standard USB based um, mini PCI it has to be a USB based one there's the STM32F um, okay. 
camera on there, microphone here, speakers on there, I haven't put a headphone socket on, I haven't booted this up yet because I've got a heck of a lot else to do. Anyway, let's have a look. Oh, we've got some whiteout going on. We have some pings. Okay. SSH. Per a s s w o r d. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm going to put you back up here. Excuse me while I do some magic. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, about to unplug the thing because it was spiking the. And let's plug the HDMI in. Ooh. Oh, data. Oh, <laughs> step in login. <laughs> no keyboard, because that's not plugged in either. No, it is. Chug, chug, chug. That now, uh, we've only got the screen set to 1280 by 720 at the moment. I'm just recompiling the kernel to get, uh, take out the forced uh, memory buffer, so frame buffer size, so we can do dynamic. G -o -o -g -l E dot or the Yeah, my door is it new to Oh it does take control tab. P slash BBC dot K dot UK Grind grind Chanda Chanda Ugh. Honestly. Hey, awesome. Um yeah. yeah let's try just try Yao Tiab dot com. Let's see if this happy Midori HTML5 thing does anything. Uh, Helen in Fast and Furious 6. Ooh, I want to see that. Chanda Chanda. Come on. Get to move on. Hey, we've finally got to something you probably can't cope with. Let's have a look. Move the mouse on this one top. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, spinning wheel. 
<laughs> this will be funny when I put this on YouTube. It'll be YouTube on YouTube. Uh, Quite a lot. Oh, whoa, whoa. Is it doing something? Mm. We're getting a spinning wheel. As you can see, I haven't run this before. All oh, very good for a demo, isn't it? Anyway, I think that's enough uh, for a first run. Uh, it works which is fantastic. So, thank you for watching.